All right, folks, here's the situation. I got an hour till class starts. And I thought I'd come and try the stocked pond that my buddy knows. So uh, we'll see how we do out here. I fished it before, had some luck. Fished it before, I haven't had luck. But it's pretty sweet no matter what, so let's see. Looks sweet at least. Look at this, man. This is goals. If I could get this out here, wow. Wow, wow, wow. First bait I'm going to try is this white shad swim bait. Let's see how it goes. There's a fish, baby. There we go. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not a bad way to start it off, folks. Uh, not bad at all. Pretty large mouth right there. Nice and healthy, thick belly. Just let him go. Oh, one for one. That's a great way to start the day, huh? Why shad looks pretty in the water. Maybe I'd even bite it. It was pretty cold last night, so I kind of expected the fish to be pretty tentative. It's 50 right now though, and it's sunny and gorgeous, so I don't know. We'll see. There's one. Where are you going, buddy? This one might be pretty decent, folks. Oh, a smaller one, actually. Good fight, though. Good fight. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Choked it. Just choked it. Right off a log over there. Not bad either. Not a bad start, huh? Pretty fish, man. I love bass. Two for two here. Not two for two. I've had a couple more, but two fish to start off the bat. That's what I meant. Dang it. There we go, flicked out. That's how you flick it out of the tree, folks. You don't reel up right away because then it'll, the hooker, it'll get tangled in the tree. You just gotta let it flip and then use the limb to launch it back out. Believe me, I know I'm the king of that. There's one. There we go. There we go. 
What's going on? I can't tell. This is not really fighting. Not bad, not bad, not bad at all. Choked it, choked it again. Boom, boom baby. Little one, but I'm all right with that. Three fish so far, not bad. Take that every day. One thing, folks, I'm using a barbless hook. That's what the... Go try a new spot here. I'm gonna cast right along this log. There's one. Ooh, choked it. Get out of there. Get out of there. There we go. Sitting right under that log, folks. Gotta be careful not to slip here. Oh, not a bad one here. Not bad at all. Easy release with that, uh, Marvelous hook, but that's a thick fish, folks. Not bad. Right along that log. Literally came out from under there. A little slippery here, almost went down there. Well, let's try the other side of it, huh? White shad, baby. Nothing there. There's one. There we go. Can't see him. What is this? Oh, he's not, wasn't fighting there for a second. Another bass. Beauty. See you, buddy. White shad, baby. Works pretty good. Power bait. I think it has a little scent in it. Not sure. Killing them. What is that, five now? Five and 15 minutes? That's not bad at all. Well, it's 11.30, got 30 minutes left. Five fish so far, that's not terrible. Oh, the wind, stop wind. Ooh, right by the Sure. I'll take it. I'll take it. Choked it again. Just choked it. Barbless hook. Nice and easy. Not bad. See you, buddy. 
six fish. Another one. Jumped. Oh, I hope you guys saw that. It's pretty. Consistent chunks, baby. Consistent chunks. Boom. Nice fish. See you, buddy. All right, I'm gonna call my shot here. I guarantee I catch a fish on this cast. Well, never mind. Stay humble, folks. That's the lesson there. Stay humble. All right, folks. That was a pretty fun day of fishing. Uh, I just wanted to let you guys know what kind of bait I was using and uh, go over the day. So I had an hour to catch as many fish as I can before class. Don't worry, I made it to class on time. But I was using this uh, power bait swim shad. Worked like a charm. So I just want to let you guys see that. That you can get a local bait shop or whatever. But uh, uh, <clears throat> stay tuned for some more videos. And uh, keep on following Grizzly Man Outdoors, baby.